Child of Light, the wonderful looking 2D scrolling creation from Ubisoft Montreal is coming out on the 30th of April and if you want to get the lowdown on the game, you're in the right place. Your character Aurora is stuck in a world of sleep where she is given a quest to bring back the sun, the moon and the stars in order to return to her father the Duke. Now this might sound pretty floaty, well it is and it's got a magical vibe too but these are both great features of the game. What is instantly impressive about Child of Light is the way it looks from the backgrounds, the font, the poetic narrative and the music. Even the movements of Aurora are dreamlike. The artwork in this game is the striking feature about it all and with Child of Light using UBR framework you can see that this engine is great for 2D titles. You'll have seen it in Rayman Origins, Legends and you'll get a look at it in our upcoming game Valiant Hearts. This game has a flavour of co-op with your firefly companion Igniculus. The little blue ball of wonder will be helpful in and out of battle and with tasks dotted around that only your firefly can complete, he'll be a great help. It is also operated separately to you and moves individually which is cool as it adds another layer to the gameplay. The combat is of course the main part of this artistic RPG and interestingly it uses a similar active time battle system to that of Final Fantasy, a great combat mechanism. You reach a certain point in order to select your move and then depending on the move's length depends on when you cast it. Your move can be interrupted if your enemy reaches the cast point while you're waiting to cast but your little firefly friend can slow them down by shining his bright blue butt in their face. This can also be avoided by instant defense taken on your move. Also, depending on how you approach your enemy during gameplay depends on who gets the first go. If you surprise strike them from behind, it's yours. If they ambush you, well, it's theirs. You'll also be able to advance in combat with a skill tree available for upgrades when you level up. You'll earn XP and new items on completing battles and you can craft oculi with gems you discover and earn, which can be mounted to your equipment increasing your odds, strength and defense. You've got HP and MP to use on your go and your Firefly can help out again here as Wishes, which are little plants dotted around the world and within the battle arena, can be disturbed which release light for your Firefly, HP and MP for Aurora. You'll also gain other characters to your party which will aid you in battle with a swap choice between party members. But something definitely worth noting here is that you are unable to see your competitor's HP. A slight change in their physical appearance is the only way to gauge it. Once you progress in the game, you'll be gifted with a map for faster travel, a different way of moving around, and you'll work your way in different directions around your skill tree. It's not all about combat, definitely not. There are mini puzzles within the platforms to progress, lots of people to talk to who will grant you side quests, and things to collect such as confessions, which have some lovely poetry on them. All in all, this game is incredibly beautiful looking and a delight to play. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel for our Game On exclusive review coming up soon. See ya.